All right, hey, this is JD and FIA. We're in the key of B major. All right, we're going to take this simple progression. And we're going to advance it up, add some passing chords to it. All right, that basic progression there. All right, so just kind of go through. All right, so we're going to start on that one. That's our B major. All right, and then we're gonna go through a seven three six. All right, so we're gonna turn that one instead of going from the seven straight to the six. All right, Let's look at a couple of different options we can do for a seven three six. All right, we're gonna keep this video simple. All right, kind of break it down to you. That move there to get you to four. All right, so we have. One. When we hit that seven, we're gonna play a B flat minor. Uh, we're gonna play a B flat uh, seven flat nine, flat nine sharp eleven. All right. So we got B flat as our one, uh, A flat as our dominant seven, B here is our flat nine, and E is our sharp eleven. E flat will be our eleven. E will be our sharp eleven. All right. So we have just basically. You look at it, it's A flat, B, and E, B flat in the left hand. And we're coming out to D flat, E flat to hit the chord. All right, to get to my, so that's my seven. All right, and we'll show you a couple of different more sevens you, or, you know, chords you can do right here too. But for this one, we're just going to keep it simple, and we're going to slide down. So we're on the seven, all right. A flat, B, and E, which is going to slide down to the G, B flat, and D flat, and move to, to the E flat in our left hand. So now, now I have an E flat seven. That's my that's my uh, seven. That's my three, and that's going to set us up to, go, to get to our six, our E flat minor seven. So we have one seven. Sits. When we play that sits, I'm playing, keep it simple, playing A flat, E flat in my left hand, right hand playing a B major chord, second inversion. So G flat or F sharp, G flat or F sharp, B, and then E flat. We're going to call everything flats here, E flat. So A flat minor seven. So once we get to that sits, we can do this move to get to our four. All right, and I'll show you a couple of different ways you can play that four. All right, so uh, before we do that, let me show you a couple. Let me just move high in order. So for that seven, we had this chord. Another chord you can do is you can play this chord here. I have a A flat, a fully, if you look at it, it's just a fully A flat diminished. A flat, B, D, F. All right, and you want to start reading these chords out. So if you start reading out the intervals, you'll see you have a, a seven, flat nine, major third, and a fifth. So a B flat seven, flat nine. All right, and then we're gonna go to our three. We can go to a fully uh, G diminished seven. We're gonna keep that diminished chord going. So I have my E flat in my left hand, right hand. I'm playing a G diminished seven, G, B flat. D flat, E, and then it's gonna set me up to get to my six. All right, so once again on that seven. So once again on that seven, we're gonna play that A flat diminished seven. So we got one. That's the sound you'll get. One, seven, three, six. If you want to spice that up even more. All right, you could you could say one, play that seven, play your three up here, and then come here for your six. See, real time. All right, so kind of do that. So when I did that, so really all you're doing, I'm just inverting the chord. So we're starting with an A flat diminished seven. I can 
play that as a beat minute seven if I want to. Over to B flat. And then go to the B flat to minute seven. Over E flat. To your A flat minor seven. So you have those different options. So one, seven. Alright, so then once we get there, we're gonna walk it down. Alright, very simple. So we're on that six, the A flat minus seven. We're just gonna move our from the record right hand, we're gonna move our thumb down to L. Alright, and we're gonna move our right hand to G and D. That's gonna give us a G seven flat uh G seven sharp eleven. No, oh, G seven flat thirteen. Sorry. I had to read the chord. So we got G is our root, D is our fifth, F is our seventh, B is our major third, E flat there, all right, is our flat 13. E is our 13, G 13, flat 13. All right, so we got, all right. Then we're gonna play a G, uh, we're gonna play our five chord as a minor seven chord. So we're playing a F sharp minor seven, G flat, G flat minor seven, however you wanna look at it. So left hand I got a G flat, D flat. Right hand I got my E, my seventh, my minor third, A, and then my fifth. All right, and then, then we're gonna go to the one. And when I go to that one, that B, gonna catch that E flat there. So I'm on the I'm on the E gonna move to the E flat while I move to the B. Alright. So one seven three six drop down one or two to five one minor five one and then when you get to that four, you keep it nice and open like that to that E major seven there. All right, I have my E in my left hand. Right here, I have my major seven E flat. My third, which is A flat or G sharp, we're gonna call it A flat. And then our uh, major seven to get up top. All right, if you don't wanna go that distant, if you wanna go something else, you can even play a sharp 11 since it's our four. So we could say, Our sharp 11. All right, A is our 11 for E. Sharp 11. Not too much there in this video, but on the four chords, you can play that sharp 11. Comes from that Lydian scale. All right, so I'm just playing A flat, A, hitting that, hitting that uh, B flat, which is the Lydian sharp 11, and the E at the same time. Then hitting the rest of the chord. Something like that. Also, when you get to that five, that four, you can play this. You can play this right here too, like a B major chord. All right, so kind of give you that sound. All right. And so if you do that, when you get to that that uh that E flat there. You can play this A flat, D flat, and G flat in your right hand. Hope that didn't confuse you. All right, so let's keep building. So we got one, all right, we got our seven, three, six. We're gonna keep it moving. Drop down to our four, sorry about that. All right, and when we get to our three, we can play our regular. B major chord over E flat. So E flat, G flat, and then just B over E, over e flat. And then I walk up to get back to the one.
out to D flat, E flat, play my two. All right, so I got D flat minor seven, D flat, A flat, D flat, right hand, A flat, B, and then E, coming out to D flat, E flat to get there. When I get to that, I'm gonna play two. I'm gonna play that three. You can play how you want to, but I'm playing E flat, E flat, right hand, G flat, and E flat. Just that. That's it. So now I'm gonna get to that E. I'm gonna play this G flat, sus, G flat, A flat, D flat, over E. Then we're gonna walk up from the five, six, seven. So G flat, so. Also, you can play tritone subs the whole time, just real quickly. Play the one. And just walk it down half step. So I'm gonna play. I go slow. A flat and D flat for my seven over B flat and F. And then I'm gonna move down a half step from A flat to G, and from B flat to A. Keep the same, everything else. All right, go to my. So, here is my substitute for my tritone sub for my three. All right. Here it sounds like a tritone. So, one, seven, tritone sub to the six. Walk it down. And then five tritone sub. That, that tritone sub is for the uh, for the one. So we got five. When we get to that five, G flat seven, G flat minor seven, minor five. Then we're gonna go just move our thumb down to E flat and move to F. That's our tritone for chord for the one, for the one, the B. Just going down to tritone. So one, seven, three, six, up down, tritone, tritone sub, and then hit that. Any one of the four chords that you want to hit. So yeah, I just wanted to get on there and show you something simple. Hope that helped. If you've got any questions, please let me know. Thanks.